Hi, I'm Paul, your Handlock Locksmith. If you're watching this video, chances are you've just been searching for handle lock for French doors. Great news, you're in the right place. It's exactly what we're going to look at in this video. Okay, so let's have a look now at Lock Lock. Lock Lock is, uh, well, it's been on the market for about two and a half years now. Um, it is a British standard two star handle. Uh, the reason it's two star is it is the highest um, number of stars you can have on a handle. However, it does separate itself from all the other two star handles by being the only handle on the sold secure list. So I think by virtue of accreditation, we can officially call this the most secure handle on the market. Um, so let's have a look at why. So it operates very, very easily. So this here is the internal side, which you can see just operates on a switch. Um, all you do, so you can see the door is unlocked there. So you lift the handle, push that switch down, and that completely deadlocks the door. That cannot be manipulated from the outside. And the reason for that is all the locking mechanism is built onto the inside of the internal part of the handle. And all it does and how it works is when you pull this switch down, it drops over the spindle inside the handle so that you can't pull the handle down. The spindle itself is a patented design. So whereas a standard spindle would normally just be a, a flat square, which in theory, if you manage to take the outside of the handle off the door, you would be able normally to push a spindle through the door or pull it out the door towards you so that the hand so that the handle on the inside would just drop off on this spindle here you'll see the, a small knuckle here so when you push this in when you're changing changing the handle over you push the the spindle through the door and then when that knuckle hits the mechanism the, the spindle won't go any further so that stops you from pushing the spindle out into the door to make the um the handle drop off on the inside then on the inside of the door, on the internal part of the handle, you have a pair of grub screws. Um, when you fasten those onto the spindle, they will then grip the spindle on the inside. So that stops you from being able to pull the spindle out of the door and the knuckle stops you pushing it back into the door. We mentioned that this works by gripping the, uh, the spindle, stopping you from pulling the spindle. So if somebody goes absolutely crazy and really goes absolutely crazy trying to pull this down while it's locked. This little groove here just in front of the knuckle is actually a sacrificial part so this spindle is designed to break if it's under attack in that kind of a way. Someone's really trying to force it so that will deliberately break so that this handle then will just spin round and round and not actually control the door in any way shape or form. Because locking the mechanism is on the inside even if somebody managed to strip this completely the lock would stay, or the handle would stay and, and sit pretty on the internal side of the door so that it, it, the door remains locked, even if you took everything off. But that's not gonna be easy to do either. The screws on the handle are 20% thicker than, you're not, than a, a normal or your, your standard um, handle screw. Um, so they're gonna be a little bit tougher to, to bend and break. The two screw, the two handle sizes I mentioned while we're looking at the screw, um, the screw fixings. This one here is what we would call a long handle. This is 211 millimeters between the two screws. On a short handle, the the top screw would sit below the handle grip here. So from here to here would be a measurement of 122 millimeters. Most doors, by the way, that are sort of 10 years or less, I would say 95% of doors, roughly. Uh, will fall into one of those two handle sizes but before you order the handles it's worth just double checking on the door that you're planning to put these on uh, before you order so um, the curved design is um, although it's extremely easy on the eye that's actually a security uh, feature in itself so Ordinarily, with a standard handle, what uh, a would-be lock-snapping burglar would want to do would be to grip the handle, pull the handle away. Uh, most of them tend to either bend or snap around here when they when they grip them, and then they set about going to work on the cylinder 
to then bypass your door security and gain entry. This curved design here means that they can't actually grip it. You cannot with mold grips or any other tool get any real purchase on this handle. Plus the fact it's heavy duty, the weight of it is far heavier than a standard handle and we mentioned the, the screws being 20% thicker before and on top of all of that, even if you do strip everything as I mentioned before, it still would stay locked and safe. But the chance of someone getting this off in the first place to even attempt that um, is, is very, very small indeed, particularly the kinds of tools that you, you would require to get that sort of to, to get this off the door, um, you it, they're not exactly uh, not going to be very um, well hidden. Um, they, they're going to be pretty serious big tools. Um, the appearance we've already mentioned the appearance being easy on the eye, and this is a nice shiny new handle here. Um, I guess what we want to know is, is how long will it stay looking like that? Well, the handle itself spent five thousand hours in a salt spray chamber, and you can see behind me now. Uh, that was the result, that is the handle that spent that time in there and uh, after wiping the, the foam and the, the, the spray, the, the salt off the handle, that's how it came out looking which you can see it had little if, if any effect, in fact it really looks like it didn't have any effect on the outside, perhaps on the internal side a little bit but the outside, the bit that we see, the bit that matters uh, no effect, which is why the manufacturer offer a 20 year guarantee on the appearance that this isn't going to be rusted uh, by the elements. So the appearance is going to stay true probably for as long, I would say, as long as you have that handle. Um, so the other and final thing to mention really, so we've got the handle on the, on the block here um, alongside a, an all cylinder and for doors that you would used to come in and out of your property, whether it be front door, side door or back door, um, that's a pretty neat combination. It does mean that when you leave the property you can't lock, 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 but you're still going to lock the door from the cylinder as you normally would. And actually, as we mentioned before, because you can't grip the handle, even when the handle isn't locked, it's still protecting the cylinder. So um, it's not completely redundant when it's not locked. Uh, so you could put this in any door, However, where we have a lot of our customers buying them and, and fitting them is with the keyless version. So um, this is perfect. If you have three or more doors uh, or entrances to your property, you only really need two. They'll be the one that you naturally use the most. You'll need a second one, just in case anything ever happens to the first door, whether it be a lost key or if the door broke, you would need a plan B. Always think about having a second entrance to your property. Um, but for a lot of people, particularly when you're talking about French patio doors, um, that tends to be their third um, entrance to a property. And therefore, you never ever use the key on the outside. You only ever use the key to lock the door from the inside or to open the door to go into the garden. They never ever use the French doors to actually gain entry and are never likely to. So the keyless version of Lock Lock is a tremendous option because any would-be burglar thinking about snapping a lock, there is no lock to snap. So it would literally sit on the door just in place of your old handle and you can see there the difference. That, um, it, it's it's uh, visually very impressive um, and again because it's deadlocked and that locking mechanism is on the inside of the door still safe. What you also gain is a fire escape because it is a keyless escape, it's just a flick of the switch on the internal side and you're out into, into your garden if you're fleeing a fire. Um, and even if you're not using it as, a, as an escape, uh, the day-to-day -day convenience, particularly in summer when you're wanting to just pop into your garden, um, the day-to-day -day convenience is, is fantastic. So they, uh, that would be my recommendation um, is for third, or if you've got three or more uh, doors uh, or entrances to your property, then Lock Lock uh, Keyless is a fantastic option. Okay, so thank you for watching this video. Um, I hope you've uh, found this useful. Um, if you do want to know anything more, you can by all means get in contact with us on 0800 002 5258. Head over to our website if you want to learn more at helpplots.com. We'll also put in a link um, around this video depending where you're watching it. We'll um, 
uh, we'll put a link in there so you can go to direct to a page where um, where we specifically show videos uh, about uh, or more videos about uh, Lock Lock. Uh, we'll also put a link uh, to the page at helpbox.com the uh, to the shop page where you can buy Lock Lock now fitted if you're in the West Yorkshire area. Uh, there are five colours. We fit Lock Lock in white or black for seventy five pounds. Um, we can also fit in chrome as you see here. Uh, we also do gold and a brushed steel. Uh, they're 95 supplied and fitted. Um, or on the shop if you fancy fitting this yourself, uh, we can supply across the UK. Um, and the white and black you can purchase for just £40. And the chrome, gold and brushed steel uh, you can purchase for 60 So very cost effective. Um, and as I say, um, the links are around this video. If you don't want to get in contact and speak to us, again, by all means, give us a call on 0800 002 5258. And we'll look forward to speaking to you soon. Thank you.